In the first game of the playoffs, a must win, the Southern Ohio Copperheads outlasted Cincinnati, who just ran out of steam. First, the Snakes were coiled against the wall, down 2-1 to one in the second. The offense added three runs in the bottom of the second for a 4-2 to two lead. Starter David Starn brought the steam below boiling point and allowed four base runners in his final four innings of work. He says what it was like to be called on for the first playoff game. It felt good. I mean, I knew everyone was coming out ready to play, and uh, my defense was behind me, and um, Billy called a great game back there, and it just felt good. While Southern Ohio would not add any more runs, they didn't need them. The Snakes' venomous bullpen of Zach Botcher, Trey Pop, and fireballer Zach Sterling struck out seven of the ten batters they faced. Sterling says the rowdy crowd pumped him up. Oh, definitely, yeah, the crowd definitely helped a little bit, especially that last batter, 2-2 two -two count, and they were going crazy, so I think that got, gave me a little more extra mile per hour on that last one. The Copperheads beat the Steam 4-2, to two, the same score of last year's championship, but now in the Ched's favor. Next up is two-seed Hamilton, who head coach Mike Florak says isn't in for an easy time. We'll have our work cut out for us with Brent Suter tomorrow, but Hamilton's got to be looking at Wazak and saying we've got our work cut out against Waz too. So two of the best going tomorrow night, and uh, we hope we have a good crowd out here to celebrate. Reporting for the Copperheads, I'm Maddie Coon.